Uh, hi, this is just a quick video to show um, uh, something quite cool in Microsoft Ice, which I didn't really know existed before. Um, and it, it's good for creating sort of like uh, photos that look like they're taken with a, a really big sensor camera, like a medium format or something like that. So I've uh, taken a video. Uh, just try to make this a bit smaller. Of just um, a scene, just sort of uh, moving the camera around just to cover a larger field of view, but in video. Then uh, while looking for, I tried to do a few sort of, um, I tried to do some stitching in uh, uh, Photoshop's photo merge and uh, it couldn't, I found it had some trouble with out of focused areas so I found out about this uh, Microsoft Ice or Image Compositor, uh, Image Composite Editor, which is actually pretty cool because um, you can do this kind of thing as well. Which is for, uh, no, it's broken. Okay, so that only took a couple of minutes really, uh, but you're presented with a nice stitched stitched up image here where you can just sort of choose your crop. <laughs> Export to disk. Struggle to stop. And here's the kind of effect you're left with, which is the same shallow depth of field from quite a, a long telephoto, a long telephoto with a wide aperture, uh, but with a much wider, much wider field of view. Uh, I think I'll probably kind of kind of find this quite useful for capturing environments um, quite quickly with the using video rather than taking stills, as I found that. Uh, usually I don't take enough stills or by the time I've taken a, a sequence of stills the scene has changed or something like that. Anything I suppose you have to take into account is you have to be at a fairly high shutter speed while moving the camera around depending on how fast you move the camera to so you don't get motion blur. But uh, yeah, that's about it. Thanks.